Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Reggie Beats Media. Today we're diving into how to sell sound kits on Shopify. If you are ready to start making some guap with your sample packs, presets and loops, then you're in the right place. It's a great time right now for music producers and sound designers, as most beat makers are now using loops. With services like Splice, FL Studio Cloud, Loop Masters, Cymetics, Tracklib and more utilizing sample packs and loops, their popularity is skyrocketing. If you wanna make some money, now is the perfect time to start. While Shopify doesn't currently offer specific features to sell audio products, that's where this template comes in. The Sound Kitify template by Bitify has everything you need to start selling your sound packs online. Let's get it. Alright, first thing first, we're gonna create a Shopify account and it's free. The link in the description below. The link will play you here. And just enter your email in the text box and click on start free trial. Just click on those options, copy as I do, or you can put your own custom options. It's just default settings. Then sign up for an account. You can either use a Gmail or any email. It's quicker with Gmail. Let the Shopify set up. All right, this is our Shopify admin dashboard. This is where we're gonna be uploading our theme, our sound kits, and everything that has to be done by the admin. Now we'll just scroll down to online store and you will see currently we have theme selected and that's where we're going to be uploading our theme. Currently we have the default theme by Shopify but we're going to be adding our own custom theme. So the theme you're going to be adding is the sound Kitify. So to get the theme, the link is in the description below and it will bring you to this page. So when you get here, just scroll down and you'll see there's multiple but you're looking for what? The sound Kitify. Just click on it and it will bring you to this page. Scroll down click on add to cart, view cart, then proceed to checkout. So you can enter your shopping details right here and once you're done you can just proceed with the payment and you will get the sound Kitify template right in your email. Now we'll go back to our Shopify admin dashboard and go to add themes, go to upload zip file and you're gonna upload the file that you've downloaded which is gonna be called Sound Kitify template. You're gonna click on open and click on upload file. Give it a couple of seconds. Okay, great. Now our theme is installed, but before we can get to use this, we must set up two apps. So we'll go to apps and here we'll search for meta field click search okay you're gonna install this free app called metafields guru click on install then click on install again okay great now you go into our second app now go to apps again and search for digital file download it's also a free app so scroll down you're gonna select this one then click on install install again okay great now we are done installing our required plugins now we have to set up our meta fields if you go to products and we click on add new product which is our sound kit you'll see if you scroll down there's no section where we can upload our audio so we'll just discard this and go to settings then go to custom data then select products and then click on add definition so the first one you want to add is the preview audio right so we'll call it audio preview and the name here needs to be audio preview this is very important this needs to match this you can write anything but this has to be audio the preview then click on select type and it's a file and you're gonna make sure that it accepts all files and it's just one file because this is the preview audio the one you see on the storefront then click on save okay cool now we're gonna add the second one okay now we're gonna add our second definition and this one is called audio demos or stems you know so here we're gonna call it also audio dot demos namespace and key is very important that it needs to match this but here it can be any name now we're gonna go to select type and it's a file 
but it's a list of files this time because we need it to be a list of stems and it must accept all files and click save okay great now we are done setting up our meta fields let's go back to our dashboard since this website is dependent on the product you must add your products first to be able to see how your website will look so we'll go to products and add a product and a product is our sound kit so this one will call it ama piano sound kit you can put your description very hot so the media here is the featured image like your cover image so i'm gonna go upload my sound kit cover image and here it is here and i'll click on open okay then i'm gonna scroll down then here i'll put my price and it's showing in rents because i'm in south africa you can select if you just text or not then you scroll down you can remove the track quantity or you can put it there if you want to show how many products are still left you untick this because it's not a physical product then you scroll down and here's the part we upload our audio demos so we're gonna first start with the audio preview click on select and i'll just go and upload from my computer click on add file and i'll select the melody Alright, so as you can see, we're getting an error and it says file format is not supported on trial plan. That's not a problem. Now we're going to convert to the plan that is $1 for the first month. Because we're just trying it out. If you don't like it, then at least you just lost what? $1. So I click on select plan and let's just say $1. Then you can enter your banking details and you'll only be charged just one dollar for the first month and for the months going up it will be 25 dollars a month which is the only payment that you only pay because it comes through with the hosting and the website the template you only pay for it once so i'm gonna enter my card details so now you just need to enter your business address details here i'm just gonna quickly enter mine click on confirm business address Okay, great. Now our plan is active, so we can go back to products and click on add new product. We'll add it from scratch again. I'll just fast forward this time. All right, now we're back here by the audio preview. So I should be able to select my audio files now since I've subscribed to a plan. Click on this. Okay, great. There it is. It's done. So now here where it says audio demos, that's where I upload my stems it's up to you how many stems you want to upload so for now i'll just upload let's say four all right i'll also select the first one so it can be four then click done i'm click on save okay great now we have our first product so now let's go to our storefront so we can see how the website looks like so I click on online store then go to the template and select customize and first thing we need to go is to the settings first so you can enter your theme activation code okay so here you enter your activation code that you have received in the email when you make the purchase i'll enter mine here then i click save once i'm done then you're gonna go back to sections so first thing that you're gonna edit here let's start with the home page here the featured product so this is the product that you see when you enter the site so i click on this and we're gonna change here into the product that we just uploaded which is called Ama Piano Sounds there it is right there then you click save alright so now you can click on uh, save again and let's click on preview to see how that looks like so far so currently we have our first product here and you click play playing the sound that i've uploaded which is great so now let's go back to the store and go to the second section which is called featured grid card and you can see already it shows the ama piano sounds that we have uploaded and if you go to the store here scroll down you can click here and click play it plays so now we want to see how the stamps look like right for this product so you can either click on view full product details or you can click on the name here and it will bring you to the page and as you can see this is our sound kit and here's our stamps okay great this is how our products work and now let me show you how you can customize this first thing first let's say you want to customize your logo right there you just go to settings go to logo and 
select the logo. I'll just put the sound kit as my logo just to start and click save. And there's my logo right here. And if you want to change the typography, the font, you can change here as well. These are the general Shopify customization options. So if you go to featured sound packs, which is the featured grid card, and you select it, you'll have these options here on the side. Just scroll all the way down. And you can see we actually have some options here. So as you scroll down, let's say you want to change the color of the button. You can just say button background color. You can make it white. You can change the text color for the button and make it black. And now you click save. Now you can see we have a light button color. There is a lot of customization options that I wouldn't be able to cover on this video. But once you purchase the theme, you're going to get a full video on how to customize everything on this theme. So now let's go back to our dashboard. And now we want to add the file to our product. So when somebody buys our drum kit, they can get the file. So you can go to apps and look for digital downloads. And here you'll find your product. I'm a piano sounds. I'm going to add a digital file. So when somebody buys it, they can get the file. I'm going to click file. So for example, I'll just add this one and click save. And that's how you attach your files to your products in Shopify. So that's it for this video on how to make a Shopify sound kit store. If you have any questions, put them in the comment section below. If you have any feature requests, put them in the comment section below. I want to thank you for watching this video. And if you liked it, hit the sub button and like the video so I can keep on making more videos. If you want to see how to sell sound kits in other platforms, I have videos right here on my channel. I'm out. Thank you. Peace.